I'm still ahead, a teen using his summer break to give back and how you can get involved. So what are your kids doing this summer? Well, a local high school student trading in his fun in the sun for something a lot more meaningful. Teaching underprivileged elementary school students all about computer programming. And he's looking for other teen change makers to join his movement. Joining me now is the founder of Can Code, Noah Rubin, and the executive director of Philanthropy Tank, Amy Brand. Thank you so much for both being here. Good morning. Thank you. So Noah, tell me how Can Code came to be. So about three years ago, I just saw that there was a need to teach underprivileged, especially elementary schoolers, computer programming because they don't really get that instruction in school. And so I just started teaching at the Youth Activity Center. And, you know, the kids really love to be able to make their own video games and learn computer programming from a young age. So that's kind of how it started. So what is the, what is the class like? Um, we teach myself and other teenagers that I've trained. We teach um, the elementary schoolers different computer programming concepts while they're making a video game. So sometimes they don't even realize what kind of concepts that we're actually teaching them and they're just actually focused on adding things to their game or adding enemies or, you know, programming different things in there. That's so cool. No, how old are you? I'm 16. 16. This is incredible. <laughs> how many and you're looking for other teachers to come help yeah. you? Yeah. Um, like what what is what makes up a good teacher? So if if you're a uh, teenager who's interested in computer programming who has a little bit of background and you want to give back and get community service hours we'd love for you to apply online uh, our website is www.canco.us and you can apply right on our website and also we're looking for new sites so if you are a parent and you have a kid that goes to a site after school or your site director we'd love for you to reach out to us on our website and uh, you can become a site and we can teach there for you guys. Great. If, uh, during the show on CBS 12 News at Night, we've talked a lot about Philanthropy Tank. So how did Philanthropy Tank get this all started for you? So last year I won $15,000 from Philanthropy Tank to really expand CanCode. And I also got a mentor in Mr. John Scarpa. And so with those two things, um, I've been able to purchase laptops and purchase teaching materials and be able to expand especially to more underprivileged areas where they may not have those um, computers or other equipment that we might need. So thanks to the philanthropy tank, we've been yeah. able to do that. And Amy, this is a great example of how, how philanthropy tank is supposed to work. Yeah, but fantastic example. I mean, Noah just is one of our students that has a great idea to give back to the community. And through our organization, we pair them up with a philanthropic investor that's able to coach and mentor them and enhance the project so it's sustainable. So we're really excited and going to be opening up applications very soon for new ideas. We have a workshop coming up in July. So any students out there that have something that they want to structure and see take off the ground, we welcome them to apply. And again, it's any high school student who has an idea of just something they can do to help their community. Exactly. 8th through 12th grade and they can apply through philanthropytank.org. All right. And Noah, I mean, tell, tell the kids out there, I mean, just, you, you know, you were someone, you know, at one point just sitting around having yep. an idea and now look at you, what would you tell the, to the kids out there that might have an idea? Definitely if you have any kind of idea, Philanthropy Tank is just a great opportunity because you don't even technically need to start your project yet so you can just have an idea go and pitch and then you have all of these great resources especially funding from philanthropy tank where you can make a bigger difference and that's what i've been able to do and i'm trying to do with uh philanthropy tank and can code awesome. noah and amy thank you so much for your thank time you. thank you ash thanks. over to you what an awesome young man thanks you guys